What's up, my boys? Welcome to a new video. The last four days, Amelia, they have been so exhausting because we have been canyoning. We have been jeep driving and exploring the island. In depth. We've been on food tour. We've been in the garden. Basically, we've been all over the island. Today, we have decided to do the most relaxing thing on this planet, getting massage, doing some yoga, some meditation, eating a lot of food, and just hanging around by the garden and the pool of this beautiful hotel. And for most of you guys, that makes a lot of sense because I am a very calm guy. I'm a very calm guy, I mean. <laughs> I meditate and do yoga every day. That's a joke. But I'm looking forward to trying yoga because I've never tried it. Not. Oh. It was really nice to this one. Nej, <laughs> Kan vi ikke den her igen? Vil du bo med mig, hvis det var, at du boede her? Jeg vil gerne bo med dig. Vil du gerne det? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Du vil faktisk rigtig gerne bo her nu. Lige her? Ja. Manor House, eller hvad? Ja, Manor House. Det her det er den første, det er den oprindelige. Ja. Hvor er det, der kommet hen? I dit hår. I dit hår? Jamen, jeg kan da ikke finde den i dit hår. Er du sikker på den? Nej! Ah! Ah! Hey, den, den, den er, den er, den er oppe op på panden nu! meditating already going through the garden I mean the garden here is unbelievable they have like is it a hundred a thousand species that are different from around the world we haven't said where we even are Quinta Spendida the property is actually from the 19th century mid 19th century it was only the main Quinta that was here and then the owner actually was a collector of plants so he decided to create his own little botanical garden but then over the years, when this became a hotel 27 years ago, they actually decided to maintain a lot of the vegetation, even though they were expanding it to be a hotel. We are having a prego. Of course, we are in Madeira. We had it um, when we went canyoning, and that's where I personally fell. Oh, it was uh, so good! I remember that. It. Yeah. And um, apparently, it's like it's like a sandwich, but a Madeiran. It's one. a steak sandwich. With a, in a bolo di caco. They actually promised rain today, but somehow it's been sunny. 
And sitting here and looking at the Ilias Desertas is um, a magnificent view. And I have this burning need to go there one day and, and, and stand on top of it and just say, I've been here. It's like out there, like a little mystery, you know. You can't go there, really. You can take a boat, but I think you need some kind of license. Uh, Pedro, who has a yacht, that goes there sometime. And um, you have seals and all kinds of... Um, Why don't we ask him to go with us? Maybe he wants to take us. Maybe we should pay him, because otherwise I don't think he will. <laughs> but let us know, guys. Have you been to Elias de Certes? And if so, is it that interesting? Welcome to our humble abode, the master suite. The spa suite. Is it the spa suite? It's called the spa suite. Because we are going to the spa room. This is the view. Look at this. Uh, but it's raining. God damn it! Jon, Jon. I made it. What is it? I am studying the wellness menu, Jon. What, is, what are we having in the wellness? I think you, you need some yoga. So we starting out with one hour of massage and uh, I couldn't be happier. I thought it was yoga. And then pleasure. I always say pleasure before work. You can pick between three massage oils. Of course, as a calm guy I am, you don't pick, I don't pick the one that's for people with anxiety and anger, anger and irritability. I pick the one for fat reducement because Portugal is making me obese. Ladies. Vand er, er nok vand. Det findes ikke. Jeg elsker vand. Det ved du godt. Jeg mangler kun et glas vin, så mit, øh, min verden completed og dig. You know, Puncha is really growing on me. And I loved it from the beginning. But Amalie, 
as I used to say, if I relax one bit more, my panties will turn poo poo. So? Oh, we're actually having the same food as we had yesterday because for some reason we're craving Thai food. I mean, we eat a lot of chili and this chili, like normally here in Portugal, when you ask for a chili and they come with a chili and you're like, this is not hot. And they say, oh, this is really hot. You're like, it's not. This chili is hot and it's spicy and it's good. I think uh, about now we will have to check out of Quinta Splendida and enjoy the rest of our time here alone, me and Amelia. And then we will see you at the cooking class tomorrow, which will be the final chapter of the last five days of tremendous, splendid exploration <laughs> of Madeira. Saúde, carinho e amor. Saúde, carinho e amor. 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 Okay guys, let's talk about Sacra's vacations. They are the ones making all these wonderful experiences come true. Sacra's vacations offer 100% customized trips around Portugal, whether you want to go to Alentejo, Douro, Madeira, or basically anywhere you want. So far, we have had some of the best experiences with Sacra's vacations. And that says a lot because we have been traveling Portugal non-stop since August 2018. With Sacra's vacations, you get your own private guides who will take you around in style. In our opinion, it really is the best way to explore Portugal because you get all the right food, go all the right places, and get all the right knowledge. If you send our friend Patricia an email, she'll help you plan your dream trip. And if you mention stay class, you get 10% off your entire trip. After a long day of relaxation, we um, are back in Funchal. Today we're not only going to eat food, we're also going to cook food. We're actually going to cook traditional home-style Madeiran food. But obviously, we are not here to do this alone. Hi, I'm Louise. Um, I am a chef and I will teach you to uh, learn how to make some simple and delicious Madeiran food. Because I am thirsty from the morning and you all recognize the chic, the caralinho, carayo. I mean, I've been drinking a lot of poncha, but I haven't been making it myself. Okay, place your bets now. Will I cut my fingers or not? <laughs> no, you won't. But you won't cut the lemon either. <laughs> I'm like Kung Fu Panda, you know, when I know there's alcohol coming up, I'll be very fast. Guys, here it's very important that you hold at the thin 
part of the Caralino because then you get more spins because if you go all the way down here it doesn't spin as much and you only spin one hand you have one hand is steady another hand spins depends on the technique like uh, actually the the um, most of the Madeira ancestors they use uh, it's called the double-handed uh, puncher uh, technique that's why it's so unhealthy. I think this is where I pour, you know. This is when I like when I make my gin and tonic. This is how much gin I put in. And then you can guess how much tonic there's in. Whoops! Is that prune for the bebe? Um or my poncha? Aminia Aminia poncha. Aminia? Aminia poncha. Oh, it's good. Oh. And it's not too sweet. I, I like think it. it's the best I've ever tried. Chilly. It could be a little bit stronger. Thank you. Oh, so you have to wash the limpets yes. every time. Every time. And people think there is a male and a female because of their colors. It doesn't mean they are male or female. They are just like people. We all of uh, all of us have our own color. You are all special. Pancha and bolo de caco is one of God's. Best invention. Mm. So this beautiful purple fish that we are having today is a very rare purple snapper. No, it's not. This is a normal snapper, but the reason why it's purple is because we have uh, fermented it in a fermented it in fermented a, it in a beetroot 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 orange paste. Luisa, this looks. Unbelievable, and I can tell you that I've already had a sample of each, and it tastes like phenomenal. Magnificent. Actually, I think these lapis are some of the best ones I've ever had. And is that because <laughs> they are from the fish market? Yeah, they're fresh, and because we did it ourselves, so it tastes better. You know, this is the essence of quality of life, <laughs> and yeah. that is why we are probably moving to Madeira. But I made it. Shouldn't we just uh, wrap it all up here now and say um, thank you guys for following our um, last five days, days. of marvelous um, experiences around Madeira. This has been probably the best trip we've had for Sacros Vacations. Mm -hmm. Guys, obrigada por ver o vídeo. Até logo. Até logo. Até logo. You know, I say até logo because... Lego. Lego is like, from Denmark, you know, uh, and everybody is like, it's not Ate Luego, they think I say uh, Luego. Ate Luego. But it's Lego. Luego. It's just a fun yeah. plan words, right? <laughs> okay. Ate Lego. <laughs> and there's nothing I can do for you. If you don't stay classy too.